Off a of foggy LA-39 in Plaquemines Parish, it's hard to see what exactly is hanging off a water level pole, but longtime naturalist and Humane Society volunteer Julie Batara knows what it is. What got our attention was the pelican that's nailed to the pole out there. The pictures show that the pelican has trauma to the head and wings, and so the, it, looks, it looks like the pelican was beaten and hung. Butara discovered it Monday. She was shocked. She grew up around these birds, and it's something she's never seen before. Our brown pelican is what's hanging up there right now, our state bird, who is also endangered. I was just really shocked that any human, you know, could do such a thing. Here in this body of water in Plaquemines Parish, Butara has seen three other dead pelicans and eight with bad injuries all just this week. The gruesome discoveries continued in St. Bernard Parish, where Butara says she's seen five dead pelicans and six who appear to have been maimed and mutilated near the fishing dock in Hopedale. This is the first time that I've ever gone around there and I've seen dead pelicans. The thing is, you don't know why, you know. All you know is that it's happening a lot, and there's definite signs of abuse in certain situations. The Department of Wildlife and Fisheries is taking the lead on this investigation. They tell us killing brown or white pelicans is a violation of both federal and state laws that protect them under the Migratory Bird Treaty Act. Butera says she just wants people to understand these deaths are a serious matter. If found illegally killing one of these birds, you could face a fine as high as $950 and 120 days in jail. You could also face federal charges as well. That's the story in St. Bernard Parish. Paul Dudley, Eyewitness News.